Oh, that's nice. Yeah, so Flynn does join you though, so... Ugh. I, I, he, the thing is though, that he doesn't officially join you just yet though. You still have to wait a little bit. Like, um... I, I, I almost want to say like... It's like near the end though. Like, you know like, um... Just before you do the final battle to the final dungeon though, Atakaron? Um, I think that's when he officially joins you. Because he's gonna dip out again. Uh, later on, but... Yeah, we'll, we'll see though. I mean, I've always wanted to use Flynn. Like, well, I mean, I did use him in the PS3 version, but like, like actually see what he does. <laughs> I remember the three. The, I remember the 360 version. You played alongside him. It was fun playing as him though, but his moveset is so freaking limited. Okay, I know we're going to Miyorto really quick. I need. I need to do a scene. Apparently, I need to also go back to Mantic too, because there's also like another title I can get for Flynn too. So, yeah, God. God! Just who does that idiot commandant think he is? Barbos, Rago, even Jaeger. Alexei was behind all of them. And now he's taken Estelle. I won't let him do this. I am gonna rip him to shreds the moment we get Estelle away from him. He must receive his due punishment. We can't let him get away. Treating Lady Esteles in that manner. Alexei is no longer the man I trusted. He's evil. That's all there is to it. And he will not change. It's time for some payback. Ooh, everyone's all serious. Oh, yes. It is actually really funny. I mean, not, not really funny, though. Sorry, sorry. That's not really the right word. It's really amazing to see how people actually get when they're angry. Have you ever watched Persona 5, though? Like, the cattle, like the Awakening for people with personas. I actually really like how they emote though. That's the sign of good voice acting, dude. Okay, so apparently I need to rest here. There's like a scene that, um, oh yeah, it's like, it's supposed, it's supposed to be like Judith and Baul, kind of like a little, um, backstory for those two. So I, I think that's what it is. They eat to get this big. Oh yeah, that's right. This is like one of the random side quests that were like, voiced for some reason. I don't understand. Like, if you bothered voicing this, you could have like voiced, you know, the rest of the game. The only thing they eat is air. Any air that doesn't become an apatheia gets metabolized and makes them this size. And they can live on just that? Air contains all the necessary ingredients for life. Huh. Well, that's a little trick we humans can't do. The Entelechaea have each evolved into a particular form that best suits their needs. It takes time. Many, many times the length of a human life. So that's why they keep to themselves? even though they're all part of the same group. Yes. Human knowledge can't compare to the knowledge the Entelechaea accumulate over their lives. But even though they're smarter than humans, they don't use magic. The Entelechaea have no need to rely on magic to defend themselves, unlike humans. Okay, but magic can be used for other things besides self-defense. I guess they had no desire for power, other than to protect themselves. So they had a totally different set of values. That different set of values has led to the wars between the humans and the Entelechaea. And the two sides had to come together somehow to defeat the Autophagos in the past. Man, you gotta wonder how crazy that must have been. I don't know. Baul's still young. He wasn't alive during those times. Even so, he's been around more than a hundred years already, right? <laughs> yeah, but that would only make him around twenty in human years. I imagine Pharaoh would know about the events of that era. I wonder if he'd be willing to tell us about it. We won't know until we ask. Shall we meet with him so you can ask in person? We will soon enough. We haven't solved any of Estelle's issues, so he'd probably just yell at us again. You're right. Yeah, wow. <laughs> wow, I can't believe it. I mean, I mean... Uh, uh, I mean... Uh, that's all I gotta say. Uh, uh, Duke's friend helped us when we fell into the sands of Kagor. You mean the monster we ran into in Kados? Not a monster, an Entelechaea. It must have altered the air at the Lees and of Kados. I think I saw it before I passed out in the desert. Do you think that Entelechaea is friendly to humans? It's the same as Baul and Velius. Entelechaea can use language so we can befriend them. Right. <laughs> wow. Good, 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 good use, Flynn. It's good to know you were part of that conversation. God, man. 
God, you can just you can just see the audio quality dip like a take a method dip like Jesus Christ, dude. I don't know how you can let this happen. God, Namco, I trusted you. I trusted you, Namco. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so where's Mantic again? Okay, so okay, this is not that far. Um, so Mantic, west side of town. For okay, whatever. <laughs> okay, I just want to see this though, cause I've never seen this scene. I didn't even know this title was here in the PS3 version. Okay, so um, I have to go all the way to the left over here. And after I get past the slow, holy crap, dude! Thank you, thank you. This <laughs> the slowdown's done. God bless. Dude, like, dude, you're in front of a knight, dude. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> that was so easy. Yeah, you know, when you have two badass, you know, badasses over here. Yeah, he would have been le dead. Dude, I mean, like, you gotta tell him how it is, dude. God, I know. <laughs> he speaks from experience. <laughs> no, that's something Yuri would do. But Flynn tells him like it is. <laughs> he's the nice guy, remember. He's the goody two-shoots guy. Okay, so cool. Mark of Knighthood. Oh, alright. Oh, yeah. oh my god, dude. I, actually, I don't think you get... Oh, I mean, you have a portrait for him, though, but I'm pretty sure you don't even get, like... Oh, god. Um, because this is, um... Oh, yeah, the Luke skin actually looks good on him. Uh, Ben Rock, it's the movie. Student <laughs> body president, yeah. I don't know what this is, though, but it, it looks hella funny. Maybe it, it probably is the Tales game reference. This is definitely like Eternal Sonata. I actually remember what the game was now. So yeah, Eternal Sonata. It's Ultimate Gear skin. Uh, what's this one again? Ew. Let's <laughs> not, not watch that. That's actually a pretty nice laid back one. That's the one I used though, for a bit. Uh, uh, we'll use Luke. I never actually finished Tales of the Abyss though, but like, I played a little bit of it. Eh, it was alright. <laughs> it was just alright. Okay, get me, get me out of the slowdown, please. Oh my god, dude. I wonder if it's better on PlayStation Pro. Like, um... Like, if it's better on that one. Or if it's just... Uh... Maybe... I don't know. Maybe the Switch version or the Xbox One version is better? Who knows? But that's seriously, that's not... That's no excuse. It looks like the battle against you is over, Flynn. So when did you become aware of Alexei's Rebellion? I've held doubts about the Commandant's orders for a while. After Yuri warned me in Nordopolica, I reconsidered previous events in a new light. And you understood Alexei was pulling the strings in the incidents with Barbos, Rago, and Q Moore. When I heard Lady Estelis was being held, I was certain. I only wish I had realized sooner. Even so, you unraveled this plot on your own. We still have time. We'll get Estelle back. Right. Patty, isn't it? Will you aid us in our mission to rescue Lady Estelis? Do you even need to ask? We'll put an end to Alexei's schemes. Yeah, we will. <laughs> Hell yeah, we will. Okay, so now we just need to. Okay, now we can advance the story. Thank God, dude. <laughs> I mean, uh, I mean, it's a little better the audio from before the patch, but ugh, still iffy. Because it's both... okay. Thank you. All right, cool. I mean, so now we get to watch this anime cutscene. Look over there! What is that huge thing? It's the Heracles. 
Did Alexei send for it? Yes, well, actually, actually, I'm trying to tell. Sometimes it's hard to tell if it's like CG or, um, okay, I'm pretty sure this is CG. They kind of have these weird intervals when they can't, when they do CG and then they use, um, anime. It's like, you have to use both, you can't just stick to one. And I'm just like, okay, that's cool, I guess. Yeah, you don't know who that, and, I mean, he had the, the end of Kea had the name, but he just, that's the Antelikea okay, there he is. Stall. Yeah, and then he just dies <laughs> instantly, wow. Good, 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 so much for the almighty Antelikea, right? Alexei's still trying to get out of Thea, it seems. It looked like it got away, though. Yeah, it looked like it was forced into those ruins. Those ruins definitely appear to be the temple Bactian. I wonder what Alexei's plotting this time. <sighs> it doesn't matter what Alexei's planning to do. Right, we're just here to rescue Estelle. But if we get too close like this, we'll end up like a stall. Let's land a little bit away from it and approach on the ground. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> yeah, we don't want we don't want that thing shooting at us though. Oh cool, we actually just go in automatically. Thanks. Oh god. I remember hating this area when I first played the game. Ugh, oh, it was the boss fight. That's atrociously hard. Jaeger, that useless worm. Can't he even swat a few pesky flies? Alexei, what have you done to Lady Esteles? Give Estelle back! Estelle, come on, wake up! Estelle! No matter. As you can see, the princess's life will fade each time she uses her power. If you care for her, then do not interfere further. <laughs> Alexei, you bastard. movements. Prince Yoder dispatched us, saying that you could probably use our help. That little prince never could mind his own damn business. Well, what about you and all that pathetic bluster and bravado? Sorry, but unlike you well-bred aristocrats, I'm not perfect. Hey, you guys all right? Oh, uh, huh? What are they... They came to save us. Apparently, Yoder told them to. Alexei's inside the temple. Let's hurry up after him. Captain, please come with us and return to His Highness's side at once. Sodia? It is difficult for me to say this, but this place is far too dangerous. The one we most need to protect for the sake of the Empire right now is Pri- I know that. I know that, as a knight, that is what I should be doing. I know that all too well. Then... But this is something I need to do myself. For Her Highness, and for Alexei. Please, let me go. But... Take us there. It must be pretty damn inconvenient to be a knight, huh? How can someone like you... How can the captain possibly consider someone like you his friend? Our captain is the ideal to which we all aspire. He's the epitome of an imperial knight. And yet, for some reason when he's with you, he is not himself. Just like this last time. Whatever. If you're looking for someone to have a heart-to-heart -heart with, go bug Applehead over here. We don't have time to sit around and play guidance counselor for you. 
Sodia! No, don't! Sodia! Listen well, Yuri Lowell. Your very existence is hurting our captain. Stay away from him! She's pretty intense. All right, now we've done everything we came here to do. We ask that you please take care of the captain. Platoon, fall out! We must hurry to rejoin the brigade! Yuri! Come on, we have to catch up with Flynn. Right. If she's forced to use her power, then it'll be too late to save her or fix the air. That bastard! Using her like some kind of tool! He's gonna pay! Come on! <laughs> randomly dis- Oh my god, are you serious, dude? Yeah, just randomly, like... I, I mean, just randomly loot Patty and Flynn, and then you just go right back in, and then they rejoin the party. Wow, wow. wow. It's, it's so necessary, dude. Holy God. All right, well, yeah, we'll just watch this real quick. If we don't go after Alexei, that Antilochia we saw is going to wind up in Abathea. Even from this far away, Astal's wounds look terrible. He might not hold out much longer. I guess not even the Antilochia are a match for Heracles. Maybe that was Alexei's reason for building it in the first place. Naturally. There's no way he'd need something that powerful just to take care of the guilds. Whatever the case, we have to catch Alexei and stop him before it's too late for a stall. <laughs> yeah, but maybe if we just stop having all these conversations, maybe we'd actually would get something done. <laughs> like, saving an Antilochia. Good God, man. Prince Yoder was thoughtful to send his knights to help us. To help us? Don't you mean to help Flynn and his stall? Coming here is reckless enough, but sending help is even crazier. Doesn't that little prince understand his own position? That's the kind of person His Highness is. I'm sure that what's happened has caused him exceptional grief. Are you referring to Estelle? Or perhaps Alexei? <sighs> Both. Let's hurry. Hey, slow down. What are you saying? This is no time to be taking it easy. We don't have any clue where enemies could be lurking, so calm down. You're right. I apologize. Yuri, you guys are much more level-headed than... Don't worry about it. We're all in this together here. Hattie, are you okay? I'm okay. I'm extremely okay. Come on, Estelle's waiting for us. Let's hurry! Alexei made it sound like Ifrid was one of his men. It is true that the knights employ guilds on rare occasions, but... We don't know whether Eifried worked for him, right? In any case, that conversation's on the back burner for now. Let's go. Oh god, are they actually trying to imply that, like... That Eifried was actually, like... <laughs> he, he acted on Alexei's orders, too? Are they, like, doing shit like that, too? Oh, God. Oh, my God. We have so much shit to do with them. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, great. All right. Well, we might as well just start somewhere. Here. Yeah. All right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Cool. And then... Yeah. Okay. Thanks. Uh... I guess... I mean, I know he has first aid though, but I know I don't know if that's going to be enough for healing. Cause usually, like afterward, I use um, I use Carol mostly for healing. But okay, whatever, man. I use Carol for healing for the most part. Oh God, I have to set all these to. Oh Jesus Christ. Oh, uh, that'd be nice, sure. Oh God, holy crap, dude. <laughs> really? That's kind of cool. Okay. Well, Flynn, we got a long way to go. Holy crap, dude. Demon Fang, Sonic the Shining Falcon. Oh, yeah, I took that off, though. Luminous Sight? Huh. Okay. Well, whatever. We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out as we go on. Shit. <laughs> I still hate the stupid aiming for the Sorcerer's Ring, dude. Let's eliminate them. Okay. Yeah, this is like an interesting team, don't you think? Ooh, we're a little bit. Uh, we're a little bit below, but that's fine. Nice.
Oh, come on, really? <laughs> really? I like that random stun, too. It's, it's gonna be so funny to actually get that. Yeah, you get him, Flynn. Wait, I don't need to level that up anymore. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I forgot I have to be leveling up this. Oh, what the hell? Whoa, what the hell is that? that whatever it did, that's kinda cool. That was, that was actually kind of, that was kind of cool. I don't know what the hell Flynn did, but that was actually kind of cool. It probably had to be, um, one of the skills with Ares, the, the weapon that he had on, though, with the, um, magic spell that he just did. Yeah, cause I, oh god, I, I guess first aid will be okay, though. At least you can be used at a distance, and it's better than fucking Carol's shitty nice eight smash. Okay, um, what are they gonna do? Oh yeah, oh yeah. I don't know how long Flynn stays in the party, though, but I'm gonna try to get this real quick. So apparently you can have Flynn cook cream stew, and it becomes bee stew. So, uh, I don't know how- I don't, I don't think we're gonna get it, but um... Yeah, cause I don't remember how long he actually stays in the party. Maybe I'll just clear all the enemies out of here though, and we'll just um... And we really now, uh, uh, no. we'll just um... We'll watch the skit first and then- oh. Wow. Uh, okay. I, I thought these were all new. I guess I couldn't have been more wrong. Okay, cool. So, there's nothing here, and there's nothing- Okay, there's a chest up there, so maybe- I don't know, maybe this guy might be- I don't know. <laughs> I don't know! I don't know what's in here! What- <laughs> What enemies are new and what aren't new? <laughs> God damn it, dude. How much does Alexei know about the Apatheia? I only heard that a terrible power dwells within them. If the Union gains possession of them, the guilds will be able to resist the Empire in actual war. That's why the knights were sent to gather and watch over them. To the point of kidnapping Estelle and bringing out Hermes Blastia? Alexei has wicked plans for the Apatheia. But what exactly are those plans? Alexei is still after the Entelakea Estal. Estal is the Entelakea from before. Anyway, let's just rescue Estelle, grab the bad guy, and then make him talk. Right. We should hurry. Ugh. I kind of have a bad feeling that maybe the skits were, like, recorded, um, after the main game. Because it really feels like the main game is a lot better quality than the freaking skits. Which is, you know, kind of stupid in my opinion. Damn, I'm noticing a pattern with the new characters, actually. <laughs> actually, I don't know about Patty, but Flynn burns through TP, like, so fast. Like, oh god, please no some restraint, young man. Okay, so now I want to, like... Okay, screw everything else I have right now. I want to learn Super Chain 5, which is more combos. <laughs> I can use Shining Fading Drop into, like, uh, I don't know, like, Shining Dragon Swarm or something. <laughs> something, okay. So I can definitely, I think all these are definitely new. Uh, just these two actual monsters. Oh, so never mind, I can actually just fight one and just kill everything else. Alright. Oh, thank god. It feels so nice to use the sword again. Holy moly. Oh my god, I keep forgetting. I actually keep forgetting that my freaking, um... I'm kind of used to Tiger Blade being up. Maybe I should just change it back, actually. I'll just do that right now. In the middle of recording. Hell yeah, dude. I don't know what I usually put on for down. Oh, it's Brutal Fang. That's what I usually have on. Uh... The... the... <laughs> yeah, it's usually Brutal Fang. Yeah, 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 I remember why it's, um... Shit. Um... Uh... 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 uh sure. We'll whatever. Yeah. God, when you have a set pattern, dude. Oh my god. Oh, it's already gone already. Oh my god, thank you. Oh wow. I like that spell that he uses, what Flynn uses though, it's pretty cool. Uh, let's just kill this guy. Uh, which one is the one that has, um... I know, yeah that one. I think he's already gonna die from this. <laughs> I know. It's so funny. That one skill just destroys him. Get in our way. 
<laughs> I know, what a badass woman, dude. I love her so much! <laughs>